Welcome back to my channel. I'm gonna show you the only 2025 Song LDMI version. We can call this vehicle as a 2025 model because it will be available in the global market next year. And they are using the BYD DMI 5 technology here in this vehicle, DMI 5 version. So this is a 2025 model. I already made a video about the Song L EV version. You can also check it out. But this is a plug-in hybrid or DMI version. I love this vehicle. I came here, you know, this showroom is basically the Dynasty Series and there are another sh showroom which is basically the Ocean Series. So I love the Song L EV and DMI version rather than the Chin Pro or, you know, UN Plus or UN F because uh, I, I think this is most beautiful like the SUV in their lineup uh, we can get it as an EV version also the plug-in hybrid version let me mention if you want to import this vehicle from the Chinese local market you can let me know I will give you the best FOB price we only have the left and right version with the English interface so I can help you out and the price is very reasonable this is a rear wheel drive version it got a 1.5 liter engine along with 12.9 or 18.3 kWh battery pack. You can carry 60 liter of fuel, then your total sale to range will be 1500 km. Yes, it is true. 1500 km. Let me show you. They even have mentioned it here 1500 km. And not only that, uh, many of the Chinese local customers they also tried this vehicle. It will be 1500, 1400 around. And the price. The one I am showing you is below to 20,000 US dollar and the highest one will be below to 25,000 US dollar. So if you want to import, you can let me know. So let me mention again, got 1.5 liter engine along with ECBD transmission. It also got 12.9 or 18.3 kWh battery pack. Then you carry 60 liter of fuel. Then your total sales range, 1,500 kilometer. And the price will be below to 20,000 to the highest one will be below to 25,000 uh, US dollar. So they haven't mentioned the draft provision of this vehicle, but let me introduce you from the front. So here we got LED daytime running lights, so this will be visible in day and night. Also we got the LED headlight, LED high beam and low beam, it's a logo 360 camera and a functional grill. So let me open the front. Also we can use the NFC card at this part. These are all the pop-up door handles, you see, pop-up door one. I love the interior of Song L. EV and DMI both are amazing. As I mentioned, we got a 1.5 liter engine, not the turbo engine, along with ECVD transmission. And the power output to be power output is same. All the versions. It got let me show you one, two, three, four, five, five different versions. So the power output is, is same. 218 horsepower along with 260 newton meter of torque top speed 180 km per hour 0 to 100 7.7 seconds or 7.9 seconds so let's close it well, i'm gonna show you from the rear side so look at the rear the rear is also beautiful. It's, it doesn't look regular design like BYD Chin Pro. This is a 2025 one. You can also check it out. BYD went up. So look at those video, uh, vehicles and look at this one. This is beautiful. I love this design. So let me mention the height of the vehicle. Height of the vehicle 1.67 meter. The length is 4.78 meter. And the wheelbase is at 2.78 meter front wheel distance almost 1.9 meter rear wheel distance also 1.9 meter and they're using the kum ho kum ho tire with 19 inch wheels and your tire size will be 235 by 50 r19 they're using the byd brake the basic brake not the brand one and the ground clearance it will be around 35 centimeter doesn't have the air suspension but you will get enough ground clearance and here at the right side we got the charging port so there are two charging port slow and fast one if you use the slow charger it will take around two to three hours to charge your 
at 12.9 or 18 kWh battery pack, but if you use the fast charger, then it will take only 20 minutes. At the, on the left side, we got the fuel tank, fuel tank capacity 60 liter, and fuel cost will be 3.8 liter per 100 kilometer. And also, look at this design, it doesn't have the radio antenna at the top, so we got a uh, LED tail light. This is called the Chung Wat here. This is a new design. It looks beautiful. Also, we got the 360 camera, so many parking sensors. There are two exhaust, both are functional. Let me open the cargo. This is a very huge vibration, but also, see, got the, the hardly cargo. So, let me check out the cargo space. It will be. 459 liter 459 liter but if you down your second row then it will be 1550 liter this is more than enough also we got the light in a cargo so if you open the cargo in a dark place no problem at all this is the hydraulic one just press here it will be closed so the song l ev version or dmi version doesn't have the regular byd design this is beautiful one and if you want to import, you can let me know. I'll give you the best FOB price, just like the local price, you know. So look at the interior. This is all the soft leather. Front seats are electric. But the rear seats... This version doesn't have the rear electric seat, but if you prefer, you can choose another version. Let me close it. Let's close all the mirrors around. 你好,小弟。在呢。切换成英文。好的,稍等一下。So you see, we can change the interface in English. A lot of customers, they are coming and just playing the music. So first, let me show you. Here, the trunk open and close. We can do it from here. Skylight here. Start closing. Window. Open and close, so you can do it from the screen. Also, let me show you the mirror. They haven't mentioned the drag coefficient of this vehicle. It should be below 0 0.30 CD. Even they have done a great job with the noise reduction as well. See, so it's really noisy, but in, inside, it's very quiet. We can choose different colors to make our interior more colorful. Font rear. So as I mentioned it, this is a rear wheel drive version. So only front seats are electric. You can activate your seating seat muscles. But if you prefer the rear electric seat, then you have to choose the performance edition. The price will be below to 25,000 US dollars. And what else we got? So we got the Delink D Pilot, which is same as the other lineup. Okay, it's something. So driving as is safety. So these are the same the BYD technology they are using. And we've got one air fan at the right, two in the middle, and one in the left. Also this version doesn't have the auto hood, but if you prefer the auto hood, you can choose the uh, high-end performance one. We get another screen here, so you can see the CLT screens and the speed of the vehicle. Let me show you the mode, normal, eco, sport, and snow field. So you can drive it into four different modes. Also, we get a camera here, so it can help you to shake your steering wheels. If you don't focus on driving, you get a leather steering wheels, which is power adjustable. So here also we get a hook. So if you want to adjust your steering wheels, you can do it like this way. There are no paddle shifters. And we can rotate the screen. Also, we got a compartment box at this part. So these are the same concept. And here we got the wallet charger, two cup holders, also we get a box with the armrest. So you can drive this vehicle as an EV or AGV version. This is your hazard button. I'll mention the EV CLT screen so later. Uh, we get a big panoramic sunroof, not the glass roof. So you can open this sunroof. See? This is cool. And only below to 20,000 US dollar. Even though you can drive it 1,500 kilometer, uh, another one will be below to, performance one will be below to 25,000 US dollar. We got, also got a, com, a sun glass box here, lights. See the light, you can touch it, it will be open and close. And if you want to close the cover, 
so the sunroof cover you can open and close it from here as well and we get a mirror with the light now let's go and check out the second row of this vehicle so the show you the second row so here we got two cup holders you can also hit it like this way like there they're really giving you the best materials best uh you know overall it's really best if you compare with the sale designs and the uh, price of this vehicle so i got enough leg space enough head space here also we got two air fans also two is before uh all seats are you know leather seat high quality leather seat i'm not sure if they are using the napa leather or not but compared with the price i guess maybe the performance one will get the napa leather and the sale range 1500 kilometer and it is two and this version doesn't have the rear electric seat but if you choose performance addition then you will get the rear electric seat and look at the sunroof as well so overall it's a really good vehicle if you want to import you can let me know i'll give you the best fuv price i'm not dealing with cif there are a lot of you know problems with the cif uh, so i'm also uh, only giving you helping you out with the fov price i'm not a car dealer but i have the cooperation with byd i also have it's a good good friends here they have companies so we can help you out with the best fov price so if you want to import let me know only left and right version also we have the byd honey ev version so overall it's a really good vehicle it's a really good vehicle there is some L DMI it will be the best choice so that's pretty well I will share more new vehicles later keep supporting me do subscribe my channel until then bye bye